Welcome back to my channel. So I'm out here on Mount Charleston today and I just recently bought four new tires. Kumho, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Road Venture AT51. They are all-terrain tires obviously and they are fantastic. They ride very smooth very little road noise when you're on highway speeds. Then I decided that I was going to buy a brand new tire rim and went ahead and got rid of my donut and put one of my best of the older tires on that rim as my spare because I do a lot of off-roading and I've decided that I don't want to be caught off-road with a flat driving on a donut. Now, I understand the donut um, works really well. But again, for my purposes, because I go off-road a lot, I didn't want to risk it any longer. So I went ahead and got a full-size spare. And as you can see, it fits perfect inside the spot that the spare, the donut, fit. And you can put your my junk out of the way you can put this part usually sat on top of the donut but as you can see they actually the engineers of the ridgeline which are incredible people thank you they actually formed the trunk to fit that part perfectly now do you actually need this i probably am going to be replacing that also i'm going to get a really heavy duty jack for this truck like a bottle jack so and I know I need to get a small 2x4 which I've been meaning to get so if I'm in a, on soft dirt I can actually jack it up um, so it doesn't dig down into the dirt and even though when I disperse camp and my truck is is leaning to one side it's not level I usually pull up some rocks and I'll drive the truck up on the rocks to level it. It's better if you use two by fours. So I'm probably gonna get a few, about two or three two by fours and leave them back here. Again, um, my truck, 2007 Honda Ridgeline RTL. I love it. And other than the full size spare, I have also, gone ahead and bought an OEM hitch and I went ahead and purchased this really nice metal step. The brand is called EAPEL, E-A-P-E-L-E. -E. I got it off of Amazon. Um, I went ahead and bought a lock hitch so no one would just decide to walk by and steal it. And I'll go ahead and step on this so you can see. It's extremely sturdy, it doesn't move. So what I did was I also wrapped some Gorilla Tape around it before I put it into the hitch so it wouldn't move too much. It, it's a little bit, I think I might have to put a little more tape, it's settled in, but it's extremely sturdy. So when you're gonna step up into your bed, you can just, step up here and then obviously take the next step and then get up on your bed look at that faded roof need a paint job it needs a paint job real bad and my rails have stayed put because I've been maintaining them with double-sided tape and as you can see coming back down it's really nice so yeah the main reason I got this though is as you can see sticks out pretty nice you rear-end me in your car your car's gonna get demolished I've been rear-ended in my truck so many times it leaves a lot of scratches but it's not done any visible damage but I'm really sick and tired of people rear-ending me so your radiator is gonna get crushed the front end of your car is going to probably end up on the ground and then I'm going to be able to drive away because you're on your phone and you're distracted. So there's that. Yeah. All right. 
All right, folks, thank you again. Make sure that you do a really good thing. Feel good about what you've done. Subscribe to my channel. It'll really help me out a lot. All right, take care. Have a wonderful, wonderful day.